Thank you for tuning in to another episode of Classified Captures. Season's greetings to you from the whole team. Expect to be thrilled, excited, and my personal favorite, scared, even a little bit by some of today's clips. Without wasting too much of your precious time, let's jump right into it. We start today with a fascinating one. This footage, captured in Italy, features a remarkable marine creature known as the blanket octopus. Blanket octopi are extraordinary marine creatures celebrated for their vibrant colors and distinctive features. The females of this species boast a striking, long, cape-like webbing that stretches between their arms, resembling a flowing blanket. This adaption is believed to have several purposes, including intimidating potential threats and enhancing their ability to capture prey more effectively. Encounters with such fascinating marine life serve as a reminder of the diverse and captivating wonders that inhabit our oceans. If you have been to a stadium, then you know that this is definitely not how running through a crowd works, yet that's exactly what the uploader of the footage says we're dealing with here. Looking at the footage, it sounds almost believable. After all, we see a figure, or possibly a person, moving at such a high speed until he gets to what should have been a stop but somehow he miraculously jumps to the other side. When I watched this, I believe it was one of two things. It was either a glitch in the Matrix or CGI. I wanted to believe it was a glitch in the Matrix till my little assistant mentioned it could be the shadow of the overhead camera. That just killed all the hypothesis I had prepared. But what do you think? Glitch, CGI, or the shadow of the camera? Imagine getting home and being greeted with a scene like this. Birds flying just above your home and then dive bombing into it. For the one recording this footage, it was no hypothetical situation, it actually happened. It left him confused and shocked as he couldn't believe what was going on. Some who saw this told him his house was probably cursed or haunted. Some also thought that it had to be a logical explanation. But looking at the whole thing, what logical explanation could you possibly come up with? None, right? I want to believe the curse bit, but what do you think? If you found that shocking, then perhaps this next one might blow your mind. Yep, that's a man walking on water. I would have thought it was a prank if the one recording wasn't sitting in a boat. Clearly, this is the middle of the ocean, which leaves me with one question. How? But I guess that's a question I should be comfortable with not getting an answer to. What say you? Still on the bazaar, do you believe in aliens? If your answer was the stereotypical no, then how do you explain this? This footage was recorded by a pilot mid-flight. He noticed a strange glowing orb keeping up with him, and once he tried to record, it somehow shot up into orbit at insane speeds. Currently, there are no human crafts remotely capable of moving at such high speeds, which leaves us wondering, was that supernatural, or could we be potentially dealing with an alien craft disguised in that manner? My money's on the alien. What about you? This next footage was sent in by someone who could swear that they had seen Bigfoot. Take a look and tell me what you think. Do you see what they see? This was recorded by an individual whose time in the woods with friends and family was suddenly interrupted by a strange beast. For some odd reason, this beast was as large as a bear, but walked on its two hind legs like a human would. 
Some were convinced it was a bear that managed to stay on its two feet much longer than other bears, while others were also convinced they were dealing with a Bigfoot. I know it's hard to see anything in the footage, but what do you also think we might be dealing with? Share your thoughts in the comment section. Next, we have this bizarre but scary image. Take a look. That's a ghostly looking being, right? I mean, you don't have to be a believer of the paranormal to see it, but how is this possible? Well, no one knows for certain, but this image was captured by a man who had freshly moved into the neighborhood. For security reasons, I'd leave out the exact location, but instead of capturing the local wildlife, he was left with disturbing images such as this. Do you think the locals are messing with him, or has he truly moved to a haunted spot? Share your thoughts with us in the comment section. What do you think this is? A wraith? A washed-up demon? Some otherworldly creature taking form in our world? Well, if any of these and more crossed your mind, you won't be the only one. Many in the paranormal community thought so too. We did some digging around only to realize that we were looking at the image all wrong. It was the backside of a pup after all. Who would have thought? If this teaches us anything, it's that perspective matters in life. Think about it. If you've made it this far, could you please hit the like button, subscribe, and even drop a comment if you haven't already. It goes a long way to make it possible to create more videos for you. Thank you for doing so. Moving back to the day's episode. In a fascinating discovery near the Pacific Northwest, a video captured the presence of a mysterious miniature humanoid-like insect. The creature's face resembled that of an insect complete with antenna, but its body poses, well, intriguing questions. The insect appears to have two standing legs, broad shoulders, and an upright torso that distinguishes it from the usual appearance of insects. This unusual discovery brings up many questions, making us consider the possibility of hidden realms. Either that, or we may potentially be dealing with the discovery of a remarkable new species. What do you think? Imagine always hearing strange noises coming from outside your home and yet seeing no one. This happened to the owner of the motion camera that captured the footage you're seeing. He set up these cameras, hoping to finally catch the individuals responsible for playing those weird pranks and jokes at odd and ungodly hours. The only thing he ended up capturing was this ungodly footage. You can see the invisible men moving too, right? Do you have any logical explanations for it? Members of the paranormal activity believe we may be dealing with ghosts, while the scientific and logical bunch believe it could be CGI. We have reviewed the footage several times and we believe it could go both ways. Since you've seen them with your own eyes, what do you think it is? Tell us in the comments section. We'll be reading. Have you ever seen snakes tango? Well, if you haven't, this is the closest you may get. I know what you're seeing is very strange and disturbing, but believe me when I tell you, it's not as charming as it looks. These snakes are each trying to have each other's heads literally. They keep going at it until one was smacked on the head so strong that it hit the rocks and ended up stunned. After a few seconds, it recovers and slithers away in shame. Talk about the slither of shame. Whatever you do, don't ever go near these kinds of snakes if you ever stumble on them doing this. A bite from these could land you in hospital or worse. Yes, it's mesmerizing, but stay away from them as much as possible. During a speedboat ride through the forested lake, the delight of nature took an unexpected turn for a group of people when they came across a mama bear and her cubs in their natural home. Once the watchful mama bear noticed the approaching adventurers, she saw them as potential threats to her cubs' safety. Reacting instinctively, the bear started chasing them, prompting the startled adventurers to act quickly. 
Recognizing the urgency, they raised their voices, shouting and screaming to discourage the protective mama bear. In the end, the combination of human noise and the loud boat worked as a deterrent, successfully guiding the bear away from the perceived threat. This surprising encounter added an exciting twist to their natural adventure, reminding everyone of the unpredictable and awe-inspiring aspects of encounters with wildlife. Yes, that's a man being dug out of the rubble. Scary, huh? I wanted to believe we were dealing with an earthquake or some natural disaster that had left people buried. But according to the narrative that came with the video, this man was actually not there by accident. He was buried alive. We don't know why, only that he was there for days before being found. The thought of being buried alive sets my claustrophobia on high, but perhaps that's just me. Either way, he must be very glad and very fortunate to have survived the whole ordeal. Looking at it a second time, do you believe the narrative the video came with, or do you think there's more that we're not being told? Share your thoughts in the comment section. A spooky meeting with the mysterious woman in the forest left the group of friends both worried and confused. On that night, as they were driving through the thick woods, they unexpectedly came across a puzzling figure on the side of the road. Intrigued but frightened, they decided to drive around and check it out, only to find her sitting on the ground, wet with her legs spread out. Overcome with fear, the friends quickly left, going back home to make sense of the strange incident. The next day, fueled by curiosity, they returned to the spot where they encountered her. To their surprise, the area where the woman had been was wet, and as they explored the woods, they found a dugout spot in a nearby river. This unnerving encounter raises a multitude of questions. Who was the mysterious woman, and why was she there on that unforgettable night? Exploration often pushes people to their physical and mental limits, showing the thin line between bravery and risk. But as I'm getting closer, I realize it's an illusion. In this case, a bold explorer entered a cave, maneuvering through tight spaces that got smaller over time. The cramped conditions, along with water on the ground, created a tough and potentially dangerous situation. Despite the increasing challenges, the explorer kept going until he reached a point where he got stuck in the narrow part of the cave. The struggle to free himself from this situation must have been tough, requiring both physical strength and mental toughness. While the explorer's courage in the face of difficulty is admirable, it raises questions about managing risks. Explorations, especially in tough environments, need careful safety considerations and awareness of one's limits. If you loved Headless Nick in the Harry Potter series, then perhaps you might enjoy this next one. This footage was sent in by a man who claimed to have still been shaking from the experience of being in the same place as the being on your screen. Looking at the footage, I can understand why he felt like that. I mean, how else do you explain this? A man walking who appears to have either left his head at home or been beheaded. Is this the ghost or reappearance of someone who suffered a violent crime, or are we merely dealing with an otherworldly creature trying to take a human form? It's hard to say, but some of my team members also believe it might be an optical illusion meant to deceive. Which of these options do you think it might be? Before we move on to the next video, just another reminder, if you still haven't liked, commented, or subscribed to the channel yet, please do so now. I wouldn't want to send the Bigfoot after you. And don't forget to share it with your friends and family as well. Thank you very much. In a quiet property tucked away in the woods, surrounded by silence and solitude, a man works on his car near the trunk, unaware that a watchful security camera is capturing a mysterious event.
Suddenly, from the depths of the woods, a ghostly figure appears, ethereal and otherworldly. The figure glides towards the man, bending down closely, its transparent form leaving an eerie impression. What adds to the eerie nature of this event is the man's apparent unawareness. Even with the ghostly figure so close, he carried on with his tasks without acknowledging the strange presence nearby. This leads to questions about the nature of the encounter. Again, was it a ghostly apparition, a camera illusion, or maybe something else entirely? Have you ever had one of those days where you were walking and then all of a sudden, some invisible force out of nowhere pulls you to the ground? Well, me neither. For the man in this footage, however, it looks like that's exactly what happened. He was going about his business like he would and should on an ordinary day when some sort of invisible being or force pulled him down. I analyzed his shadow to see if perhaps it was a camera trick with others pulling him, but found nothing. Could this be the real deal? If it is, why would he be the target of an invisible being or ghost? Or did he take the person's job? It's hard to say, but share your thoughts in the comment section. Bears are incredibly powerful beings and they can exert considerable force when motivated. In this video, a bear demonstrated its strength by breaking through a locked door. This behavior is not uncommon for bears, especially if they're attracted to something inside or if they associate human habitation with a potential food source. It's a reminder that when residing in areas where bears are common, it's essential to take proper precautions to secure homes. This is crucial for ensuring the safety of both humans and wildlife. Understanding bear behavior and putting in place measures to minimize interactions helps create a safer environment for everyone involved. Next, let's jump into the wild and peculiar world of mysterious events. Here we have a cloud, yes, a cloud, just casually, rolling along a metal pavement at the side of the road. I mean, what in the world is happening with that cloud? Did it decide it had enough of the sky and wanted to go on a road trip? Perhaps it's the latest mode of transportation for clouds. Move over airplanes, here comes the rolling cloud express. But uh, joking aside, clouds are supposed to float high in the sky, not roll around like tumbleweeds. Maybe this cloud had a long day and needed a break. Can clouds even get tired? I didn't think they had legs, let alone the ability to roll on the ground. On a more serious note though, this might just be some clever camera work or CGI trickery. Mother Nature can be pretty unpredictable, but clouds going on a road joyride might be stretching it. Whatever it is, it certainly grabbed our attention. Hold on to your hats because we're about to dive into the mystery of the floating house. How on earth, or well, in this case, in the middle of the ocean, did a house end up there? Did it decide it wanted an oceanfront property and just set sail one day? Maybe it's the world's first seafaring home, cruising the high seas in search of the perfect view. Perhaps there's a whimsical explanation behind it, like a grand nautical experiment gone wrong, or maybe it's the aftermath of a powerful storm that played a game of pick up and relocate with the house. One thing's for sure, stumbling upon a house out at sea is the kind of unexpected encounter that leaves you questioning the very fabric of reality. Do you believe that merfolk exist? What about Atlantis? Well, whatever your belief system, you might want to see this. I know what you're seeing can be confusing, but relax. According to the locals here, you're actually looking at a mermaid's preserved corpse. Yeah, but that's right. But if Disney and all we've learned from animations are to be believed, mermaids shouldn't look this despicable and scary. 
Turns out, real-life depictions of mermaids have them sometimes looking like this. Scary, but this is what they might supposedly look like in real life. Well, it's hard to verify the claims of these individuals who've actually put it on display. It's interesting to see, since almost everyone in the footage believes that's the real deal. If this many people went to see it, that means it's real, right? Share your thoughts. Next, let's talk about the Great Black Wasp. Ever seen a wasp dressed to impress in a sleek all-black ensemble? Well, that's the Great Black Wasp for you. These remarkable insects are a stunning sight with dark iridescent wings and an impressive size. We're talking about an insect that can be over an inch long. Now, that's no ordinary wasp. But here's the thing. Despite their intimidating appearance, these wasps are usually not aggressive towards humans. They might look like they mean business, but they're generally more interested in their wasp activities, like hunting for nectar and pollinating flowers. So if you ever come across one of these great black wasps buzzing around you, you could admire the beauty of nature without worrying too much about an impromptu aerial duel. Have you ever had the experience where blood just suddenly started flowing from your tap? Well, if you answered no, you wouldn't be alone. But for the one recording this footage, it's a real-life occurrence. How would you feel if this suddenly started flowing from your pipes? I know I would freak out. As much as we love the intrigue and want this to be blood, there are some in our office that believe it might just be dirt because blood is thicker. Looking at it, I can see where they're coming from. But what do you think? Blood? Dirt? Or an elaborate hoax? Share your thoughts. It's quite amusing that humans have been on Earth for centuries and still not have an explanation to certain phenomena and situations. Take a look at this footage. A group of men went camping in the snowy mountains when they noticed something weird with the trees. Take a look. Did you see that? One of the trees is moving. This movement is not like the regular sway of trees in the wind. The tree appears to be uprooted and hovering, cascading onto the surrounding trees. It's as if an unseen force plucked it effortlessly from the ground. That can only be done by big machines, but there was none in sight, so could that have been some kind of giant or Bigfoot? And as if on cue, a second tree exhibits the same strange behavior. Just before the man recording gets terrified and flees, we witness the astonishing sight of a giant ape-like creature effortlessly holding the uprooted tree in one hand and sprinting away. That creature must be very strong to have pulled that off, but what at all could it be? I'm quite certain that it's definitely a Bigfoot. I mean, there's no other logical explanation, unless the Hulk lives there. But what do you think? This footage was taken from the backyard of a live streamer. He heard some noise outside and decided to check it out, so he turned his camera to the darkness in his backyard. Emerging from the depths of the darkness, a ghostly figure materializes, only to vanish moments later. The creature looked to be about seven foot tall with very broad shoulders. Not only was it huge and fast, the entity also appeared to be smoke-like. Could that be a ghost, an alien, or some kind of evil spirit that was out on a haunting? Tell us what you think. Normally, rabbits and hares are prey for snakes, which is what makes this footage incredibly captivating. Despite lacking built-in mechanisms to deal with snakes, the rabbits or hare in this video was putting up a fierce defense, determined to keep the snakes away from its territory. It makes you wonder, could there be young ones nearby? Is the brave rabbit or hare doing everything it can to protect its vulnerable offspring from harm? The maternal instincts of these animals can be truly remarkable. Have you witnessed similar behavior in rabbits or hares before? Share your stories in the comments section. Also, can you confirm if it's a hare or a rabbit? I always mix them up. Morse code revolutionized. 
Morse code revolutionized communication with the invention of the telegraph, but have you ever wondered what forms of communication spirits and otherworldly creatures might use? Up until now, we didn't have an answer, but that all changed when we came across this astonishing trail cam footage. Take a closer look at the footage. What do you see? Notice that ghostly being that fades in and out of reality. Now, take a closer look. There's a second one, too. What if these apparitions aren't just fading in and out randomly? What if each fade in and fade out and the duration of each phase carries a profound meaning? What if it's a form of spiritual Morse code? I know it might sound far-fetched, but consider this. There's so much we still don't understand about the paranormal, and when you watch this footage, there's simply no other way to explain what's happening. It's a mind-boggling mystery begging for explanation. Next, we have footage from another trail cam that was set up to capture wildlife. Unlike the other trail cam footage in this compilation, however, this one actually ends up capturing wildlife, just not what the owner was expecting. Confused? Watch. Yep, that's a spider. This curious little spider decided to unravel the mysteries of modern technology. This arachnid adventurer stumbled upon a trail cam and couldn't resist the urge to investigate. With all eight tiny legs working in perfect harmony, the spider cautiously approached the camera lens, displaying a determination to get up close and personal view of this intriguing device. It's terrifying because it's a spider, but also cute, if you ask me. Skinwalkers, paranormal creatures capable of assuming any form, be it human or animal, often mimic those they have encountered or harmed. Since they're not in their true form, they exhibit peculiar behavior. Now, let's look at a prime example. This deer right here. It jumps uncontrollably and bolts straight into the bushes. Following this one, another deer later emerges with its neck looking like it's been snapped to the side, but it somehow walks perfectly fine and doesn't seem to be in pain. What do you think of this situation? Could they merely be sick deer? Or are we dealing with the paranormal, specifically deer, right here? This footage may not have been captured by a trail cam, but let me assure you it's just as intriguing as anything you'd see in the wild. Imagine waking up to find your compound in disarray, with trash scattered everywhere. That's exactly what happened to this family. Curiosity peaked, they turned to their security camera footage for answers, and what they saw left them utterly stunned. At first glance, they thought it was a wild animal, perhaps a bear, but as they closely examined the video, they realized that they were witnessing something far more extraordinary, a wolf with a human-like body emerging from their neighbor's property. What made it even more chilling was the fact that the previous night had been a full moon. Could they be living in the close proximity of an actual werewolf? The family couldn't say for sure, but they decided to share the footage online, hoping someone could confirm their suspicions. However, uploading the footage may not have been the best move. Now, if their neighbor truly is a werewolf, he knows that they're onto his trail. Who knows how much longer they have before he decides to act in a peculiar manner. As you watch the footage, I'd like to hear your thoughts. What do you make of this mysterious encounter? Personally, I can't help but feel that uploading the footage may have put the family in greater danger. Have you ever had the chance to encounter a skunk ape? If your answer is no, you're definitely not alone. Personally, I hadn't even heard of these creatures until I stumbled upon this incredible trail cam video. Apparently, they're a variation of Bigfoot dwelling deep within the swamps of Florida. Talk about discovering something wild, right? These elusive creatures have a preference for solitude, and they're said to reach a towering height of at least eight feet. If that doesn't scream Bigfoot, well, I don't know what would. The footage you're witnessing was captured nearly a decade ago, adding to the intrigue and mystery surrounding these fascinating beings. Have you ever heard of or encountered a skunk ape before? We're genuinely curious and eager to know your stories. Take a look at this footage. Notice how the trees are shaking. What do you think could be responsible? 
It's clear that the usual suspects, machines or animals, can't be behind this phenomenon. It's unlikely the winds alone are responsible since they wouldn't selectively target just one tree. What then could be responsible? Well, you know who I'm thinking of, right? There is one creature large and strong enough to shake a tree that huge. Bigfoot. Legends describe Bigfoot as a towering ten-foot creature possessing an unparalleled mass and strength. Just imagine a 10-foot, 900-pound behemoth tugging at a tree. It's no wonder the video shows the tree shaking uncomfortably. But what do you think? Watch the footage. What do you see? Did you see the ape-like creature? What do you think it is initially? One might consider it to be a gorilla, but the surroundings do not match their typical habitat. This leads us to consider the potential contender, a cryptid like Bigfoot or the Sasquatch. It's however hard to tell because of how far this creature is. It's hard to tell if it's walking on two feet or moving on its knuckles like gorillas do. But what do you think? What are we dealing with here? Next, we have this very unclear yet intriguing and quite frankly disturbing footage. This trail cam reportedly captured what you see on your screens currently. It's a trail cam that had been set up somewhere in Australia as far back as 2014 to capture trail cam footage. Turns out that the owner of the trail cam captured more than he bargained for. But what exactly are we looking at here? The truth is, nobody really knows. Members of the paranormal community, however, believe this might actually be a rare footage of the Australian Yowie. For those who don't know, the Australian Yowie is supposed to be a cousin of the Bigfoot that lives in Australia. Yes, you heard right. The Bigfoot has a much larger family than we probably know. But is this footage legit though? The truth is, that's hard to ascertain due to the age of the footage and its quality. This is one of the types of footage where you actually need faith to believe. So what say you? Is it fake or is it the real thing? Tell us in the comments section. Still on Ghosts, watch this CCTV cam footage. Did you see it? Did you see that foggy creature just walk through the scene? This is a video that does not need a lot of explanation or commentary. It's hard to call whatever it is a shadow creature because of its white appearance, but whatever it is, it's just leisurely walking by as if it felt at home. Could we have just witnessed the ghost of someone who died on the property? If we did, why is it roaming the property? What did it want? Could it have died in a horrible way and was seeking peace? That we may never find answers to. But if this was your property and that was truly a ghost and not an otherworldly creature, would you stay or leave? Before I say anything, watch this video. Did you notice anything out of the ordinary? If you say no, then you are just like me when I watch the video. But it's also a revelation that you and I should never visit the woods alone as we could be in the presence of a very dangerous animal and never notice. If you look at the footage more closely, you'll see that there is a weird-looking head emerging from the branches of one of the trees. I know there are some weird-looking lizards out there, but I'm pretty sure this one isn't normal. It outright looks prehistoric. Taking a closer look at the image, however, a part of me feels that this might not be real. As much as I love the paranormal, this image looks manipulated to me. But perhaps that's just me. Perhaps there is a dangerous prehistoric looking lizard out there and the owner of this footage was just lucky to have escaped unharmed. But what do you think? The ocean is so large and mysterious and as the days go by we keep discovering new creatures emerging from it. Take a look at this. What is that in the water? Looks like a hybrid of a rat and a snake. This creature was found by a fisherman. The creature is entirely white and possesses a long neck along with piercing black eyes that seem to stare directly into the camera. Is it some type of undocumented fish or is it merely fake? Tell us in the comments section.
Next, we have this CCTV cam footage, which is beyond weird and disturbing. These two young men were walking at night and were spotted on camera. A few minutes later, one of the men just vanishes into thin air. Upon closer examination, when the other guy disappeared, a sudden horizontal blink of light appeared, a scene reminiscent of alien movies where extraterrestrials arrive in their saucers to abduct humans. The light came and left as fast as the guy had also vanished. It's also possible that he stepped into a mysterious portal, teleporting him to another world or a different location on Earth. The truth behind this perplexing event may forever remain a mystery. Meanwhile, the unsuspecting friend continued walking, only later to turn and check on his companion. To find him vanished. Filled with fear, he quickly fled the scene. What do you think, though? Is this real or a fake? What would you do if you cross-checked the CCTV cam outside your property to make sure everything was fine and discovered a rather peculiar and paranormal-looking creature moving right outside your property? The creature doesn't seem to be walking like a normal human being. Instead, it looks like it's running, yet not normally, but weirdly. It almost looks like The Flash does in his movies. But here's the strange part. This creature is pale white with an ethereal appearance. It's perplexing because we can't determine whether it's running, gliding, or even floating. The owner of the footage is truly freaked out and wondering if the neighborhood is safe. Just imagine the unsettling feeling of doubting your neighborhood's safety. It's not about thugs lurking around, it's the fear of unseen otherworldly creatures that keep you on edge. It must be tough being them right now. If you've received a dollar for every time I asked you if you believe in ghosts on this channel, you'd probably be a millionaire by now. Yes, that's an exaggeration, but you get the idea. Either way, I'm going to have to ask once again. Do you believe in ghosts? If you answered no, boy, do I have a video for you. The trail cam originally set up in the woods to capture animal activity ended up capturing something unexpected a man walking through the woods. Upon observing the area, one can discern that despite being in the woods, it's a frequently traversed pathway by people. The presence of a well-used pathway indicates regular human activity in the area. There's just one problem, though. This video was captured very late at night. Very, very late. Nighttime in urban areas is considered dangerous in many areas. How much more the woods with unpredictable animals and possibly dangerous people? Interestingly, the young man in the video appears unperturbed by these potential risks as he leisurely walks into the frame. A few seconds into the video, however, we confirm what I've been saying as he's suddenly attacked by an unknown person. Correction, did I say person? I actually meant an unidentified being. Whatever attacked him is clearly not human because, unlike the young man that's clearly visible, this being or creature or whatever it is seems blurry. Did a ghost just push him over? Well, the exact answer remains elusive, but one thing is certain, the footage has not been edited. So tell me, what do you think we're dealing with here? A ghost or some otherworldly creature? Or do you have a logical explanation for us? This creature was captured on camera perched on a tree branch. It looked like a winged gargoyle with bat-like ears and distinctly unusual wings unlike those of any bird. Due to the distance and low lighting, the camera couldn't capture a clear image. However, based on our observations, the creature exhibited humanoid shoulders, a bird-like head lacking a beak, and curiously displayed what seemed to be ears on its head. As the creature moves about, you can see its legs like that of a spider or a person. It's hard to tell from the camera quality. The paranormal enthusiast wants to believe this is real, yet it blatantly looks fake. It looks like a bad case of CGI to me, but what do you guys think? Once again, we have another person thinking that he has superpowers, so he goes out into the woods to check out a weird noise he heard with only a camera in hand, but what he saw left him traumatized. As you can see, this person is walking through the woods when he stumbles upon a tree. Just as he's about to go around it, a tall, alien-like creature emerges from behind the tree and the video abruptly cuts off. 
Now, I don't know if it was Halloween, but if it was, then that was a hell of a realistic costume. If not, then I'm sure this person is traumatized for life because that creature looks hideous. Like something out of a nightmare. Not many believe it's real, though. They argue that the facts don't add up and that it's possibly a hoax. What do you think? Back to the subject of Bigfoot, take a look at this footage. The uploader of this video was also going through the woods when he came across a being he didn't readily recognize. Although the uploader didn't disclose the exact location, the area was known for its serene and tranquil atmosphere. While the area hosted various animal species, they were predominantly smaller in size. This area was not known to have apes, yet right before him was this creature. Initially, he contemplated the possibility of it being a gorilla, but as he began filming and zooming in, it became evident that this entity defied any gorilla resemblance. It had to be something else, something much larger and stronger. He believed it had to be Bigfoot. After multiple viewings, we have scrutinized the footage extensively, yet its clarity remains limited. Based on what we can see, it's hard to tell if that's actually Bigfoot or not. Although, however, it's worth noting that the creature's fur resembles that of Bigfoot, and its presence in the region devoid of any ape sightings adds to the plausibility of the Bigfoot theory. Considering these factors, the Bigfoot theory gains credibility. But tell us what you think. Still on Bigfoot and trees, let's take a trip to Mississippi. Take a look at this footage from 2015. In this footage, we catch a glimpse of an enigmatic ape-like creature meticulously tending to a tree. The creature's actions remain a mystery, but one thing is clear. It displayed an unwavering focus and determination to complete its task. Unbeknownst to the creature, a man was quietly filming from behind, unnoticed due to its intense concentration on the task at hand. Now, if you're a regular here, you know my advice when encountering a strange and unknown creature, it's best to keep your distance, who knows what they're capable of. Sadly, not everyone heeds my advice, and this man came dangerously close to paying the ultimate price. Initially, the creature's size may not seem remarkable, but soon, the reason becomes apparent. In a surprising turn, we discover that the creature was actually initially seated, and once it rises, it reveals its full height and astonishing size. It was at this point it realized that the owner of this footage was filming him, and he gives him a chase. We don't see the creature, but we hear its footsteps. How the owner of the footage survived is still a mystery, but what do you think? Are we dealing with the real thing here? Or is that just a gorilla or some other form of ape? Could this entire encounter be an elaborate hoax? Share your thoughts with us in the comments section. For our penultimate clip, we've something rather interesting. While a family of raccoons was traveling, they encountered a coyote. In response, the raccoons sought refuge in a nearby tree. However, the hungry coyote leapt to attack one of the raccoons. The intended prey, unwilling to become a meal, fought back by clawing at the coyote, causing it to shriek in pain and hastily retreat. Raccoons and coyotes are nocturnal animals, meaning they usually thrive in the night. Raccoons often become prey for coyotes, so when they encounter each other at night, it usually results in one becoming dinner while the other goes hungry. Knowing they're basically fighting for their lives, raccoons display a strong, aggressive behavior when they come face to face with coyotes. A trio went horse riding on Beaver Mountain, a woman, her husband, and a friend. The three riders were having the time of their lives and were oblivious to the third member who was quietly stalking them in the woods on their left. The woman who lagged behind caught sight of the creature peering at them from the depths of the woods. She said that the creature she saw stood about six foot tall and was brown furred from head to toe. The creature looked nothing like a chimp, monkey, or a gorilla, leading her to believe that it was a Bigfoot. The presence of the creature caused the horse her husband was riding to grow restless and behave erratically. The woman, filled with shock, silently locked eyes with the creature until it vanished into the depths of the forest. She doesn't know how she survived, but it was one of the scariest moments of her life, 
What would you have done in such a situation? Tell us in the comment section. Have you ever moved through the woods and heard strange sounds? Not animal noises, but strange ominous and airy sounds. Would you want to experience something like that? Well, the uploader of this footage did not have a choice. He was out exploring with his family when the sound suddenly started. With his camera already rolling, he made the decision to keep recording, aiming to capture the eerie sound. The sound itself doesn't resemble that of any animal, but rather a mysterious hum or the distant rumble of heavy machinery. This is where it becomes intriguing. No machine in the area could account for this peculiar sound. Residents of the area who saw the video commented stating that had any nearby factory or plant been the source of the sound, they would have undoubtedly heard it as well. Some individuals even dismissed the possibility of the sound being caused by downed power lines. Just in case you don't know, downed power lines also produce similar sounds to this. Some also pointed out that although no one knew the source of the sounds, there have been reports about such sounds all across the globe. Upon reflecting on this, we recalled encountering similar footage in the past and even uploaded a few of our own videos. We have previously entertained the suspicion that these sounds could be linked to extraterrestrial activity. However, it's worth noting that those videos are more recent compared to the footage under discussion. This was filmed as far back as the 10th of February 2012 by Antti Kraul in Finland. To think we have recorded such sounds in the US and other parts of Europe in the past few years is beyond wild. It's almost as though they were not random when were happening systematically. Given the fact that there's no plausible explanation for this sound, do you think some odd alien activity could be happening on our planet? Or is this an elaborate plan by some to gain the fair share of popularity? Share your thoughts in the comments section below. It takes a certain kind of warm-heartedness to be a farmer, especially one that works with the animals. It must feel very rewarding to feed these animals and watch them grow. Perhaps that's why farmers are some of the kindest and most down-to-earth people on this planet. But let's face it, it's not always rainbows and sunshine, is it? Apparently not. Here is a weird and frankly disturbing video from a farm in Pakistan. I mean, this is no optical illusion, folks. You're actually seeing two calves joined together from the stomach. Even though they have separate organs like hind legs and tails, they share a single stomach. When the two-headed calf or set of conjoined calves were born, the village immediately deemed them cursed. The calves were seen as nothing but a bad omen. But here's what the scientific community had to say. They explain that it's rare but a possible phenomenon where the embryos of an organism don't split properly. This possibility gains credibility because we've actually observed similar phenomena in humans too. But what do you think? Are they a sign of a curse or is it everyone just being irrational and superstitious? Now let's journey to the enchanting swamps of southwestern Florida. Behold this captivating footage, showcasing the effortless grace of a massive alligator gliding through the water, a truly majestic spectacle. When it comes to modern creatures that resemble the prehistoric lineage of dinosaurs, my hairs stand on end. The alligator captured in this footage is a prime example. If this doesn't give you shivers, I'm not sure what will. Fix your gaze on this scene. The alligator's eyes emit an eerie luminescence, casting an uncanny aura. At first glance, you might even wonder if it's some malevolent entity manifesting in our realm, but rest assured, the reality is far less sinister. This luminosity is attributed to a specialized layer called the tapetum lucidum, situated at the rear of the eyes. This adaption allows their eyes to reflect light, resulting in this captivating radiance. Beyond the scary eyes, we have the size and weight to worry about. This colossal being tips the scales at around 1,000 pounds. They inhabit both terrestrial and freshwater domains, though they steer clear of salty waters. 
While they might nibble on the occasional fruit, make no mistake, these predators are boring carnivores. On solid ground, their dash is surprisingly sprightly, yet their hefty frame exacts swift exhaustion. In some, they're a formidable threat in both swampy waters and on terra firma. Whatever you do, avoid them like the plague when you see them. Get too close and, well, you might just become history just like the ancient dinosaurs. This time, our lens takes us to Mexico, where an astonishing sight unfolds before our eyes. Brace yourselves for the extraordinary. At first glance, the footage appears unremarkable, but let me assure you, there's more to this than meets the eye. Positioned at the peak of the mountain stands a figure, a figure that, upon closer examination, resembles a human. We could discern the head, the shoulders, the arms, and the legs. However, this is no ordinary human. Allow me to paint the picture for you. Given the distance from which this footage was captured, one would expect humans to appear as mere dots or perhaps not even visible at all. Yet this figure stands out unmistakably large. We're not talking about your average basketball player's height here. No, this is on an entirely different scale. We're talking about a giant. Based on its visibility in the footage and its position high up on the mountain, we can reasonably estimate that this person is at least 20 feet tall. Now, let that sink in for a moment. A towering being defying the norms of human stature, dominating the mountaintop. It's a sight that challenges our perception of reality and leaves us wondering about the mysteries that lie beyond our comprehension. Before you go calling this a fake, remember that the last person to report something similar went missing. If that's not suspicious, I don't know what is. In this footage, we can see three dogs barking and snapping their jaws at something in the dark. Moments later, we see the trio flee backwards as a fierce alligator comes to view, bearing its sharp teeth, and the three dogs, I think these dogs were trying to bully the reptile, thinking it was all alone, but the scaly beast was not having it and decided to scare them off. Animals are known to be territorial, and it's clear that this alligator is trespassing into what appears to be a town sin. This gives the dogs a legitimate reason to assert their dominance and defend their territory. But this gator seems to not have any interest in the rules of boundaries, but rather goes ahead to bully the dogs in their own homes. This is a typical example of the survival of the fittest. The trio made the right call to run away because I think one or all of them would have come out of the potential fight limping. In this viral video, the darkened streets come alive with intrigue as a group of bikers halts abruptly, their attention drawn to a mysterious figure walking alongside the road. Illuminated by the bright lights of passing vehicles, the creature gradually reveals itself, resembling something otherworldly. Its nonchalant demeanor amidst the bustling traffic adds to the aura of mystery. With a pallid and ghostly complexion, the creature boasts elongated limbs standing at an estimated height of around 5 foot 9 based on the filming distance. As the footage unfolds, a captivating detail emerges. The creature abruptly turns its head backwards, a behavior often associated with depictions of extraterrestrial beings in popular culture. These actions only deepen the intrigue surrounding its nature and origins. Speculation and curiosity have ignited a storm on the internet, with theories and conjectures flooding the digital landscape. Some have described the creature as a weird, humanoid entity, while others have even spotted a UFO in the footage. The imaginations of watchers have been ignited, giving rise to questions about a potential alien invasion on the horizon. What do you think, though? If you thought the last Bigfoot footage was up close and personal, watch this one. The footage starts off casually looking like a normal footage till we spot a black figure in the background. It gets all shaky from there and we can barely see the subject except for a few times the cameraman captured it. Now, here's the twist. Could the cameraman's trembling hands be attributed to genuine fear, rendering the footage raw and unsettling, or might this intentional tremor serve as a clever diversion, masking the truth of its authenticity? My gut nudges me towards skepticism, hinting at a fabrication, but I'm eager to hear your take. Don't hold back. Let those keyboards sing in the comments section. 
Can trees move? Before you answer, watch this footage. We have fantasies we wish could be our reality, but if we know anything about life, it's that that's not how life works. Yet, right before you in this trail cam footage is something that looks mythical and magical. The footage unveils a forest adorned with towering trees, adorned in moss, surrounded by lush grass. Yet, the true intrigue lies with the trees right in the center of the footage. In a captivating display, this particular tree responds to some unseen cue, opening and closing to unveil its slightly carved and intricately crafted innermost part. It almost looks as though the tree is moving or breathing. Is this something magical, or is there a logical explanation for it? If there is, could you tell us in the comment section, because we'd like to know. Next, we have another image of a slender-looking creature that doesn't look like any other animal I know. The image is quite blurry, hence it's hard to tell what it actually really is. The paranormal community has been left divided on what this is. There are some who think it's a bipedal man, which essentially is referring to a Bigfoot, and then there's the half who believe that it's simply a hoax being passed off as the real thing. If you ask me, however, I will tell you that it could go either way. It could be someone passing off as fake as the real thing to gain their five minutes of fame. It won't be the first time someone has tried to take advantage of the enthusiasm of the paranormal community, and the community hates it. There's nothing more frustrating than being confronted with false positives when trying to prove the existence of something. It could also genuinely be the real thing, but only difficult to tell because of the quality of the image. It's all confusing at this point. What do you think, though? In the vivid landscapes of Silverton, Colorado, under the scorching afternoon sun, a unique adventure unfolds. Our recorder, engaged in a road adventure through this captivating terrain, had their attention diverted by a remarkable sight. Amidst the natural splendor, they captured a glimpse of a towering brown and hairy creature. A voice in the video's background whispers of an enigmatic being appearing deeply engrossed in a mysterious quest before suddenly coming to a rest. As excitement builds, another voice chimes in, emphatically identifying this elusive figure as a Sasquatch. It's an elusive creature. All right, just squat it down. Yeah, let me see your camera, I'll do it. The sight of this creature stirs the imagination and fuels the ongoing quest to unlock the secrets of these fabled and mysterious creatures that, according to legends, roam the remote and untamed landscapes of Silverton. But what do you think about this Sasquatch sighting, real or fake? Share your thoughts with us. We came across this footage online. The uploader claimed to have captured a live ghost on camera. You can't imagine our excitement as we eagerly click to witness the ghost ourselves. The footage is what you are seeing play out now. Did you see the light hit the camera right before the being flew? Could it be a paranormal being that had mysteriously been caught on camera, or is it something else? Although we have a deep fascination for paranormal beings and want to believe every footage we encounter is authentic, a part of me suspects this may be an animal, a winged creature such as a bird or a large moth. But tell us what you think in the comments section. In a place that defies familiarity, a bone-chilling spectacle unravels before a bewildered group of onlookers. They've managed to capture a genuinely hair-raising moment that'll send shivers down your spine. <laughs> Here we are, facing a man who seems to have become a vessel for some unearthly malevolent force. As the possessed man spirals into a disturbing frenzy, the air fills with his unearthly hair-raising sounds and ominous warnings. It's as if a sinister omen from the other side has found its way into the realm, casting a sinister shadow over this nightmarish encounter. But what's truly petrifying is how this man, consumed by whatever holds him, vehemently repels anyone attempting to draw near. 
It's almost like he's fighting off an unseen evil that refuses to release its grip, a struggle that unfolds with terrifying intensity. So here's the bone-chilling question that lingers. Has a malevolent spirit ensnared this man's very soul? Is he held captive by a force so sinister it defies comprehension? Or could this be an elaborate and sinister charade, a performance that blurs the lines between reality and nightmare? There are some who believe it's a hoax, but it's just too chilling and scary to be. And for our final footage, we thought we'd sign off with something freaky. What do you think is happening in this footage? If you look closely, you'll notice there's this strange being behind the woman looking at her. It's believed to have been stalking her. But why? The truth is, no one really knows. The woman seems to notice the being as well, as her facial expression changed whilst recording the video. Some who know the location believe it was built on cursed land. But then again, that's something we can't verify. What do you think the being stalking her is? We have a lot of theories, but not a definitive answer, so we'd love to hear yours. Also, do you think they might really be in a cursed land? Think about it, and let us know in the comment section. All too soon, this brings us to the end of today's episode. Before you go, are there popular trail cams out there you'd want us to look at? Please tell us in the comment section as we'll be reading. You can also send us a mail of strange and unexplainable videos that you may have recorded yourself. Just forward them to classifiedcaptures at gmail.com. We'll upload it in our next episode and give you the credit, unless you want to remain anonymous. We look forward to receiving your content. Like, comment, subscribe, and don't forget to share the video with friends and family. Enjoy the festive season, and we'll see you in the next one.